Yes! Welcome! Or I'm the one, the only Dr. Tom. And I'm back here in this hobo's hovel to discuss the finer points of grappling. For this weekend, we have the Clash Champions. An epic day in which every championship and one match is on the line. Yes, it's finally a true clash. You have champion versus challenger. The most epic proportion of athletic endeavors. As always, I shall give you my most learned predictions. Yes. Well, let's start off the night with the Cruiserweight Championship, for they've always relegated the Cruiserweights to the lower pre-show. But consistently, this is the match of the night. And here we have Drew Gulak. In a triple threat defending against two other noble competitors. Takes on Umberto Carrillo e Lince Dorado. My prediction, even though this is the end, the match of the night, Umberto Carrillo will be victorious. Yes, and become the next. Cruiser away champion. Then, oh, unfortunately, right after that, we have a match I could nap through. So, again, all you people out there watching this video for some reason, and then tune into this WWE wrestling. You can. Just skip the first match, if this is the first match. Who we have in this news of the night? Alexa Bliss and her partner from across the Atlantic Ocean, from the Jutland, the Highlands. Nikki Cross picks on Fire and Desire of Mandy Rose and Boo Donia Deville. Alexa Bliss and Nikki Cross shall retain their championships. And then for the SmackDown Tag Team Championship. We have the New Day, consisting of Big E and Xavier Woods, face the Revival, a classic tag team, in the mold of the Brain Bust, Arn Anderson, Tully Blanchard. Unlike this rabble. Revival shall win and become new SmackDown Tag Team Champion. And then a twist of fate. Seth Rollins and his later opponent Braun Strowman. The monster among men. The Beast Slayer. The King Slayer. Take on Dolph Ziggler and Robert Roode. For this match, to set things up, Dolph Ziggler and Robert Roode shall win. Become the Raw Tag Team Champions. And then AJ Styles puts his United States Championship 
belt on the line versus a worthy competitor in Cedric Alexander. Hmm. So torn. Cedric Alexander shall... No. Math says AJ Styles ate so many stutters. The disgustingness of the Raffle Snake himself, the BMF DTA Austin 316 Stone Cold Steve Austin. I shall go with the mathematics on this. And the equation points to AJ Styles being victorious and retaining his championship belt. And then another international affair, Shinsuke Nakamura takes on The Miz. Very simply, The Miz shall be the greatest intercontinental champion, for he shall regain his belt and be victorious. And then these two, for some reason, they do not have the prestigious King of the Ring tournament on tonight for the Clash of Champions. But instead, they relegate King of the Ring to Monday, where the common plebe can witness the coronation of a new king. But instead, they choose to go with Roman Reigns, the man who dare committed. Homicide against him. Eric Rowan. Everyone knows how strong Roman Reigns is. Roman's reign shall be victorious. And as a bonus, one Daniel Bryan shall make an appearance. Indeed. Then we have the women in their endeavors again. Bailey versus the one true woman's champion whose parental lineage and tutelage should gain her this championship. I'm talking about the one and the only. Apologize for my exuberance. But Charlotte Flair shall win the SmackDown Women's Championship. And then the corresponding title in the Raw Women's Championship match. It's Becky Lynch versus a returning Sasha Banks. Hmm. That, red, that blue hair contrasts with the red and white belt. Indeed. Sasha Banks shall defeat the so-called man and become the Raw Women's Championship. And then in my stone cold lock Kofi Kingston shall be vanquished by the Viper, Randall Orton. And Randy Orton shall become the WWE Champion. Then in the main event of the evening, Seth Rollins. Seth freaking Rollins. Beast Slayer. Beast Slayer. The Architect. Takes on the monster among men. The man who promises that you shall get these hands. 
Braun. Roman. Will Seth add Monster Slayer to his title? Nay. He shall not for a broad stroke and shall become the Universal Champion. As always, on behalf of that hobo who's off doing his ever hobos do hobo tom i the learned cultured dr tom and i bid the adieu and please enjoy not only this show but clash of champions again if you do like this presentation please like share comment and subscribe and then we can debate the finer points of grappling in a more civilized fashion. Farewell.